that's the intro. That's the template I downloaded. And then when I, as you can see, when it go, when I, uh, because I, like, as you guys can see right here, usually it would roll out, like roll, continue rolling for like 15 more seconds. But that's way too long. What's happening guys, my name is Alex, welcome back to a brand new Vegas 14 tutorial and in this video guys, I'm gonna show you guys how I made my 2017 intro. Now, first of all, before this video starts, I wanna mention that I changed the intro music just to be safe with copyright issues. So what I did is I just downloaded the Migraine from NCS, that's a really awesome song, and I just used that one as my intro song. I, I switched it back from, I think it was Black Coast with like a really difficult name. So I switched the song. Uh, from that one to an NCS song just to be safe in terms of copyright. Now, basically, I want to mention that I did not create this intro myself from scratch because I'm a really big noob when it comes to create like really um, like layer for layer for layer flashing, glitching out in like intros. So I just downloaded the preset. So this video is kind of like how I made my intro uh, from a preset. So as you guys probably saw in the beginning of this video, I'm going to show you guys how I made that intro as well. So as you can see right here I have my preview screen open and it is just basically a template that I downloaded and it has all the layers for me into the actual the Vegas file so what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to show you guys layer per layer what I use uh, to in order to create this intro so basically what I did first of all is I just picked migraine the song from NCS so how, how this works is I'm always like showing a little sneak peek of like the video and then the, the, the music fades in slowly it builds up and then my intro comes and then boom the video starts that's also happened to this video as well so this is basically how it looks so we're just gonna pretend that this black screen is just a little part of the video like showing you what I'm going to do in today in, in, the, in that video that you're watching. So if I play back the video, as you can see, it is just really silent and a black screen because this used to be the video. Then the music fades in and then as you can see, it is starting to build up. You can see the both the fades in and then basically it goes into the actual intro. Boom. So as you guys can see, this is not from the template, this. I created this myself. So what the intro that I the template that I downloaded is basically this. That's the intro. That's the template I downloaded. And then when I, as you can see, when it go, when I, uh, because I, like as you guys can see right here, usually it would roll out, like roll, continue rolling for like. 15 more seconds but that's way too long for an intro i would say like 10 seconds max what i would do is or like this intro is like specifically that it catch the eye immediately so i had to cut it off short because otherwise it wouldn't fit with the song so how i did that is i just pressed s on my keyboard and cut away an entire part and i just cut it off short and then i added in this effect and as you can see the background the background is black but what you're going to see is the flash and then the black is a video and then you see just Alex Halford when the video is playing and then it fades out. So that is my intro guys. It is that simple. I just added a, uh, a song from No Copyright Sounds. As you can see, this is like a, another part from this one because I had also I had to uh, cut it off short in terms of the song. So I had just had to because this is like the first drop of the song. So what I did is I just uh, placed the end part of the song. I cut away like the entire middle section and I just placed the outro, the last like 10 seconds of the song to the, you know guys what I'm trying to say, to, just to create from the drop to the end to make it sound like it's like a 10 second song. So uh, what I did, I just uh, downloaded just Alex Alford as a regular font. Uh, the font is called Bellow Script. And then what I did is I just downloaded also a, I think this is called a lens flare and I just place it on there and that is how it looks So this is my 2017 intro guys. It is that simple nothing too fancy and this is how I did it So thank you guys for watching that is it That's all I have for you guys today So thank you guys for watching and thank you guys for subscribing as well Make sure to subscribe down below for more Vegas 14 tutorials because we're going towards 100k and we're gonna hit this within a month So I'm really stoked guys So thank you for the support and I will catch you guys tomorrow for a new videos always on Saturday So I'll catch you guys tomorrow just Alex Halford.